Live television is so exciting, right? It's not scripted, so if you have an embarrassing moment, it's there for an audience to see. For the rest of the world, that moment is paused, rewound, and paused again. If you're brand new, first of all, welcome. Second, make the richest part of your daily routine by clicking on that red subscribe button. My luggage. In September 2016, during the presidential campaign, Donald Trump visited Ben Carson's childhood home in Detroit, Michigan. Of course, Dr. Carson was present and was in the middle of an interview with CNN when he realized he forgot something, his luggage. Why is this an epic pause moment? You can actually track and see when Dr. Carson realizes he has lost track of his luggage. He's very theatrical about it and leaves the anchor standing high and dry. But before you judge, have you ever had something you forgot suddenly pop into your mind? Yep, that's the moment. First day of school. Admit it, if you had the chance to go back to pre-kindergarten where you could have snack time, nap time, and play time, you would. But when you're in that moment, like little Andrew Macias was, it can be overwhelming. The reporter asked Andrew if he'll miss his mom. At first, he says no. But then you see him realize he's growing up and he starts to cry. While endearing and a little bit heartbreaking, we've all been in Andrew's shoes at some point in our lives. Some of us might have even had a similar moment on Monday when going back to work for the week. Chair Trader For poor Bill Murray, the chair definitely betrayed him. While filming the penultimate episode of Late Night with David Letterman, Murray jumped out of a cake, chugged some vodka, and was clearly having a good time. As he was slurring his words, he was stumbling throughout the set until MSNBC's last word. Murray can be seen stumbling around as a crew person helps him to sit down. The actor and comedian lost his balance and fell over in the chair. There are so many moments to pause as you watch Murray's epic descent to the floor. Ask Me Anything on June 14, 2015, during a Fox & Friends broadcast, Jeff Prospery was performing during the segment. The West Point student was the principal drummer for the school's band, the Hellcats. During the broadcast, Fox News anchor Pete Hegseth was doing an axe throw, and the weapon went over the target and hit Prospery in the arm. While the video of the hit was captured on cell phone, it supposedly wasn't seen during the broadcast. But the faulty throw was captured on air. When Prospery's incident went public, people went back to the broadcast footage to see if they could capture the poor drummer hobbling away after the screen cuts to the band. Quiz time! It's going to require you to be a bit vulnerable. What was your most embarrassing moment? How did you handle it? Tell us your answer in the comments and be sure to upvote your favorite answer. The winning comment will be pinned to the top and get a special shout out from us. Blowing smoke. We've all been irritated with the media at some point in our lives, but it's a whole other thing to do something about it. On live television outside of the Caboolture Magistrates Court in Queensland, Australia, news anchor Alex Bernhardt tried to interview a woman who was supporting an accused murderer. The woman wasn't fond of being interviewed, so she blew smoke in Bernhardt's face. As the woman walked away, Bernhardt followed. Then the anonymous woman put out her lit cigarette on Bernhardt's face and said, get out of my way. The woman was charged with public nuisance. As the interview went viral, people paused for the blown smoke and then the lit cigarette hitting Bernhardt's face. Scooter Crash Live television segments can sometimes be unpredictable, especially when an animal is on set. But for Fox 11's Lisa Breckenridge, she had a smashing experience during a product segment. During the show Good Day LA, there was a product presentation for ideal Christmas gifts. One gift was the mobile adventure design, Scooter, which could go up to 25 miles per hour. Breckenridge wanted to ride it, lost control, and ended up crashing into some equipment. The pause and replay were definitely pushed many a time, as Breckenridge not only knocked over a TV, but hit her face pretty hard. Miracle of Life Move over, Fifty Shades of Grey, because these cows are celebrating the miracle of life with cameras recording. During an early morning broadcast segment in Oklahoma City, news anchor Mitch English tried to make the best of an awkward situation. All he could say was, We gotta make cattle! While his co-workers back at the studio watched in utter shock. Cicada Attack 
In June 2015 at Fort Riley, Kansas, the cicadas awoke from their 17-year beauty sleep and swarmed the base. For poor news anchor Katya Leek, she couldn't even get through her segment because they kept swarming her. Unfortunately, her cicada freakout and attack was all captured on film. But if people are judging, it's a bit hypocritical. How many of us have freaked out because we had bugs on us? We've all been there. One cicada even landed on Leek's mouth, which was a popular paused moment as she tries to save herself. What was your most embarrassing moment? How did you handle it? And what would you do if it was caught on live TV? The answer with the most upvotes will get that coveted pin to the top and their 15 seconds of fame with their shout out from the richest. Also, check out our other videos and tell us what you think. Thanks and bye bye.